I'm a musician. I play the trumpet in a bunch of different bands around town. Uh, one day I was watching my band leader. He was setting up his iPad. So he usually reads his lyrics off of his iPad. I saw him try to plug it in. The cable was short and it forces him to connect the cable to a hanging extension cord and it looked really stupid. And uh, after a few minutes, the weight of the extension cord unplugged from the cube and I saw him pick it up, plug it back in, he turned around, went to do something else. And then the weight from the plug unplugged the cable from the iPad and fell down to the ground. And he went back down, picked it up, plugged it back in and just kept doing this kind of like weird yo-yo dance and it looked really funny. Uh, after a few seconds, I ran over there, ran my idea by him, and he was like, oh man, I would have bought one of those yesterday. And uh, it just kind of like slowly became the uh, humble beginnings of the MZ7 Smart Power Station. The point that made it get over the hump was I actually, uh, I was at a networking mixer at the Harbor Club with some friends, and they knew some people that I didn't know. And uh, I guess they had been talking to these two ladies who had been from the Charleston Chamber of Commerce. And uh, I think they were, they were talking about me and they were saying that uh, I had some, a lot of good ideas. And uh, I guess the two ladies from the Charleston Chamber of Commerce, they approached me and they said that they wanted to meet with me over coffee or something, maybe lunch, and uh, just kind of like pick my brain. So they heard that I had a lot of ideas and maybe they can help me push them forward or you know, see some of them through to fruition. Um, I met with them, it was really cool, and uh, they mentioned Perfect Pitch to me. I don't know, like it, it wasn't something that I, I felt was that good of an idea to be validated. And then uh, I kind of just like did it anyway. <laughs> and I, I ended up winning, which was cool, and then once I won, I was like, okay, I guess this is a good idea. Uh, I'll start a company, I'll run with it, and move forward. You know, there's some, some people in the music, music industry that I wanted to connect with. That, I, that I'm working towards connecting with. I actually connected with uh, uh, one of the guys from Moody and the Blowfish, uh, the guitar player. I actually met him at, at the Dig South demo day and he checked out my product and he thought it was really, really cool. And so we've been in a little bit of communication. Um, yeah, so uh, really the milestones for me is just, just like the validation, meeting people, getting the, the great ideas. Uh, to kind of like improve my product. That to me is a really big part of business. Uh, just like putting myself around people who could help me learn those things. Because at the same time, it brushed off. You know, it completely brushed off because before I said I knew nothing about business. I had all these ideas. I didn't know what to do with them. And now I have a, a physical product that was once just an idea and people believe in it and it's moving forward. You know, maybe slow, but slow motion is always better than no motion and I'm okay with that.